This video is sponsored by Babbel, one of the top language learning apps in the world. I've always been so impressed by people who can speak more than one language, but when it comes to learning languages myself, it's always seemed really intimidating. But thankfully, Babbel knows how to make things easy and fun with their lessons crafted by real language teachers. There's exciting games, podcasts, live classes, so much to keep you engaged. I especially love the podcasts. They feel like you're eavesdropping on conversations in your desired language. Conversations like planning a birthday party, ordering food, discussing weekend plans, all sorts of things that can have real life applications. They also have fun games like Phrase Maze, where you have to get past ghosts by proving your mastery of the language. It makes the learning process so much more interesting and painless when you have a variety of different ways to practice. Quiero tomar un jugo. Quiero tomar un jugo. Quiero tomar un jugo. Voy a pedir una chela. Voy a pedir una chela. La cuenta, por favor. La cuenta, por favor. Babbel does have a few different subscriptions to choose from, including a lifetime subscription. Click the link to get 60% off your subscription today, and be sure to let me know what language you want to learn and why. Hello. I hope that you are doing very, very, very well tonight. Tonight, we have Eddie joining us back there. He's sleeping soundly because uh, this evening I went over to my dad's house for dinner and my dad has three very rowdy dogs that Eddie loves to play with. He always has so much fun with them running in circles around the yard. But tonight it was a little much for him and after about an hour of playing he jumped up onto my lap which is pretty standard, but was not standard was that I was sitting up in one of those really tall, like, bar stool seats and I didn't know he could jump that high. It was crazy. He did, like, the most insane flying leap up onto my lap to try to get away. He was over it. I'm drinking a cup of tea that I really like to have at bedtime and especially right before I film. It is the throat. Comfort from Yogi. It's a caffeine free herbal tea. In this herbal blend, we combine licorice root with slippery elm bark, used in Western herbalism to help relieve minor throat irritation. Wild cherry bark helps soothe and add sweet flavor along with orange peel. Enjoy our throat comfort tea when you need a gentle and comforting blend to soothe, soothe your throat. It's got wild cherry bark, licorice root, fennel seed, cinnamon bark, orange peel, slippery elm bark, cardamom pod, ginger root, mullein leaf, clove bud, and black pepper. Love to have that with some oat milk, and it's just a nice, really mellow, sweet flavor. It's very relaxing before bedtime. I just got out of the shower, not just, I got out of the shower maybe about half an hour ago, so my hair is at a point where it is damp. It's no longer dripping wet but it's also pretty far from dry. So what I'm going to do at this point is apply a small amount of the Olaplex number six bond smoother. Leave in reparative styling cream, reduces frizz, nourishes, and protects. The directions say apply a very small amount to damp or dry hair. Concentrating product on your mid-length to ends. Comb through and style as desired. Concentrated leave-in smoothing cream. Excellent for all hair types, including colored and chemically treated hair. Strengthens, nourishes, and moisturizes. Speeds up blow-dry time while smoothing. Reduces frizz and flyaways for up to 
72 hours. I really like using this stuff when I'm going to be using a heatless, heatless styling technique. Like these leave-in curls I'm going to be doing because over the course of the night, I toss and turn quite a lot and my hair can get frizzed up from that. But this stuff helps keep my hair shiny and smooth and prevents it from getting as messed up throughout the night. So the curls just set in nice and neat. Willow Witch's wig that I wanted to wear for the Winter Fairy video was so catastrophically, hopelessly tangled. I looked up a synthetic wig detangling tutorial and the lady said that she swears by the Tangle Teaser. That's the only thing she ever uses to detangle her wigs. She said it works miracles, which I'm sure it can, but Apparently, I can't work miracles because that wig was hopeless. <laughs> Her technique was to mix half and half water and fabric softener in a spray bottle and tiny section by tiny section spray down the wig and work out the tangles bottom to top with the tangle teaser. Good technique, but yeah, it wasn't enough. <laughs> couldn't save the wig. It felt like the more I tried to, the worse it got. So I just bought a new one, unfortunately. But I'm still glad I bought the Tangle Teaser because even though it didn't work for my wig, it works great on my real hair. I've been really liking it a lot. So brushing out all the tangles. Making sure that that leave-in cream is evenly distributed throughout all of my hair. a kid somehow hearing about the concept of brushing your hair 100 brush strokes every single day. I don't know where I heard that, if it came from like a girl at school said she did that or if it was in a storybook or a movie or something. But I just remember when I was 10 thinking that 100 brush strokes before bed just sounded like the most elegant princess sort of routine I could possibly imagine. To me, that was the peak of pampering. I wonder how long that would take. Okay, 
Let's see. Imagine if you could do this to your spine. That'd be so sick. It makes such a nice soft crackle in the background of the smoothing sound. Oh, unexpectedly wonderful trigger sound discovery. I already thought this product was a miracle find because of how happy I've been with the heatless curls it's given me the few times I've used it so far. But now I'm doubly happy with my bridges because it sounds Over, but I also want to include the raw sound from the video along with it so that you can hear the brush strokes or whatever. But then you can also just hear, like, in the background. 
god, alone editing. I'm like, oh my god. Why do I sound like that? Now the same thing goes for the other side. I'm gonna pick up a small piece. Wrap it around. Grab some more. Wrap it around. Twice. Grab some more. reached the end. So now I can scrunchie that off. Now that everything is pretty well held in place, I'm removing that clip. I'm pretty new to sleeping with my hair like this, and it is reasonably comfortable. It's not that bad. But I've wondered if maybe like connecting this in the back could possibly help it be more comfortable to sleep in. It might be worse, who knows, but it's worth a try. Like I'm gonna connect these in the back. So just a bit more like out of the way. I don't know what this reminds me of. is supposed to help the blemish go down quicker. So first I'm going to stick that on. And even if the hydrocolloid doesn't do what it's meant to, I also will just appreciate um, the products that I'm about to apply to my face being kept off of these more sensitive areas. Now for my face, I'm going to apply the Ordinary's Multi-Molecular Hyaluronic Complex. So I'm applying just a few droplets of that to my fingertips. me quite a lot to 
to apply something to my upper eyelids it just like feels inevitable that it will seep into my eyes but I've applied this a lot of times and I have not had a problem with it so we'll continue Puppies readjusting. Get comfortable, though, baby. Okay, the hydration vaccine. I've got really dry skin, and this cream is super duper rich. So that's definitely nice. step for my face. I like to take some Aquaphor Original Ointment Severely dry skin treatment Clinically proven to restore smooth, healthy skin Skin protectant I think this really just helps seal in everything that you've applied. Create a barrier so that instead of just evaporating away, the moisture has nowhere to go but like penetrate deeper into your skin. The one side downside of it though is that you gotta go to bed with a really greasy face. <laughs> but I think it's worth it. I feel like I always wake up in the morning feeling like my skin looks so much healthier and happier and my foundation applies more smoothly when my skin is more properly hydrated. These are the best sticky sounds yet. So that, I think, does it for my bedtime hair and skincare routine. I really hope that you enjoyed um, going through these procedures with me. I'm sorry, I couldn't really think of much to say. I wanted this to be a more rambly video, but I, um, you know, sometimes my brain just goes a bit blank, to be honest. I hope you enjoyed having Bubby in the back. I think he really enjoyed um, being allowed in the filming room for once. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope that you're feeling nice and relaxed and will have a lovely rest of your day or night. I hope to see you.